Hello friends, welcome back to our tutorial, designing an impressive architectural building in Revit 2018 interior. Now let's start the project by doing some job in advance. I have already created a folder which I renamed to my YouTube tutorial Revit. Let me add a version of Revit at the end, Revit. 2018. How I create this folder, right click into the desktop and select new folder. A new folder will be created. Rename this folder to my YouTube tutorial and click outside now i'm going to delete this folder then right click the folder and create another two folder inside this folder the first one is designing an impressive architectural building in revit 2018 imperial the second one is designing an impressive architectural building in Revit 2018 metric. In these two folder, we are going to greet uh, two tutorial, one for the Imperial users and the other for the metric users. So save all your file in this folder or the file that you download from the website. The advantage of saving your file in this folder you can use whatever version of Revit that you have to follow along. But if you download the file from the website, since I use Revit 2018 for this tutorial, you cannot open those files on earlier version of Revit. But if you are using Revit 2018, you can use this file and jump to whatever video interesting you most. Now let's go and open Revit. I already launched Revit. To launch Revit, if you pin Revit on the status bar, just right click and select the Revit. Or double click the icon on the desktop if you select the option during the installation. If you are using Windows 7, click on the chart and double click program, all program Autodex. If you are using Windows 10, go to the welcome screen. Revit must be in this window and click it to launch the Revit application. I already launched Revit in the background. As you can see, this is the welcome screen of Revit. The welcome screen of Revit is divided into three areas. The first area is the project area. The second area is the family area. And the third area is the resource area. The project area where you open an existing project you start a new project from scratch you start a new project from different templates for instance in the version of Revit that i'm using you see the construction template architectural template structural template mechanical template your version of Revit may not display all of this option because i use the the Revit application sometime if you are using other version of Revit you may not use see this template but you have only two version of Revit to use for you to follow along in this tutorial one your Revit must be Revit architectural or Revit if you have Revit structure you will find it difficult to follow along in this tutorial when you look at the thumbnail in this area these are the recent drawing that I have opened the third one is the sample drawing that come to the application and the fourth one also when you come to the family area, you can open an existing family, start a new family, and create a new conceptual mass. Also, you see a thumbnail of the previous family that I opened. All the first three thumbnails are custom family that I used recently. The fourth one is a family that comes to the application. In the resources area, you can click this button to chat about what's new in Revit 2018 you can click the help button this can take you there this can open the help file for you and have more option about how to use Revit 
you can click the get started video this will play some get started video that paste on it. so now we're going to start this tutorial to use the architectural templates to do that click the architectural templates button now revit loading the template in the background this is the revit environment you see a series of things going on on the background you have the quick access to the, the tabs and the panels you have the option bar projects browser and the properties palette now go to the quick access toolbar and click the save button because i have not yet saved this project this means the save as dialog box navigate to the folder that we create for this project on the desktop you can navigate to any where you get your folder double click that folder and because this is the imperial project i'm going to select designing an impressive architectural building in revit 2018 imperial then i'm going to rename this file 00 underscore 001 underscore b i a b underscore i for imperial the last i in differentiate the imperial and the metric file the biab represents designing an impressive architectural building i'm going to click the options button because this is a tutorial i'm going to increase the number of backup maximum backup to five and click ok to close the button i'm going to click save to save the project all right now we have learned how to start a project with a template and how to save that project we're going to end the video here in the next tutorial we'll start to build a reference plan for our project if you find this tutorial useful please click the like button and share it to your friend if you have any question about this tutorial please leave a comment below if you want to continue this tutorial or any other tutorial on my channel please subscribe thanks very much for watching i hope to see you in the next class goodbye